up. Good morning. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a good day so far. I know it's been uh, pretty much hell slash hectic for you. PCM. I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, Beppa. Good morning. Just got out of bed. Hmm. Anyway, uh, yeah, we'll be continuing. I know I'm late. I won't be streaming as long today. I think recently I've been streaming for like three hours. So I'll probably go for like two. I don't know. It really depends on the loop because if I stop mid loop, the loop doesn't count. You know? So this game kind of forces you to play a certain amount of time. Don't bash your head into the wall. Yeah, this week already seemed busy enough for you, let alone with all the stuff that's broken. Breaking. Yeah. Seriously, though. The loop within the loop, whether you wanted the loop. You got another loop, because you didn't finish the loop. Yeah. So, because there's technically the loop of every single, I mean, it's the loop of the day, but there's the loop of individual time periods within that day, plus the loops that we're allowed to take if we die, we can die twice. So there's two loops within those loops, and then there's the overall world loop. There's a lot of loops. And then, like I said, if you don't even need to die, if you just simply don't finish, then you have to restart the loop. She's going back to bed. I got the blankets over here for you. Yeah, there you go. I gave you two blankets and you're gonna take my hoodie instead? I heard there's some loops here. Yeah. What happens if I refresh this page? Bear with me. Because I usually have the stream going up to my, like, on another screen just to see what's going on. But I feel like maybe, just like when I stream to Twitch, that might be slowing things down. So if I don't have the preview of my stream going, then that's one thing. But if I click to play the preview of my stream, it just doesn't pick up where it needs to. So I have no idea what's going on. That's always fun. Anyway, I think, uh... I think we're gonna finish off some storylines instead of starting new ones. Uh, just to get that out of the way. Which means we're gonna go to this fireworks container and try and find the code for it so we can blow some motherfucker up. Pretty much. I think. I think that's the plan. Uh, 
All right. This it can be done <coughs> at noon or later. <coughs> but I think it's other things <coughs> that also need to be done later, so. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah. Um. I mean, there's a couple things we could do, but that doesn't have to be done till nighttime. Or we could go look at that in the nighttime loop. Or is that morning? And that's afternoon. We're headed into afternoon. Okay. I think I'll do this one. And then we'll go to the other one. An Eternalist will leave the garage door of the Archives office open in the afternoon. The Archives office sounds dry, but it also sounds like a gold mine of information. Wanna go back out and deal with more potential problems? Oh boy. Sounds fun. I both enjoy this part of the game and also like, holy shit. Why? Uh, all right. That's horrible. When you're out of power, slab slabs efficiently draw from your health instead. I know it says efficiently, but I feel like I'd kill myself by trying to use my fucking power. I don't think I want any of these. It's not horrible, I suppose, depending on the weapon. I wish there was more slots per weapon. That's kind of nice. Wonder if that even works on bosses. Or bosses, the visionaries. <sighs> Accuracy of aim shots is greatly increased across the board. What does that mean? Like, I mean, as in, like, how does that affect the gameplay? Like, what is that actually doing? It's just more like the aim assist? You have that on one thing then yeah that makes sense I'd move around with that but I'm not sure if I'm aiming down sights when I do that yeah I suppose I am hmm 
So we'll keep that crack shot and re replace it. <clears throat> I feel like I might want to get rid of shock absorber. Absorber. I get rid of that as well. Place it with maybe mine leech. Might be able to do straight shooter as well. So I'll just sort of. Uh, I feel like there's a couple here I want to keep. Let me see. forgetting I have that on me somehow that's annoying because I never can switch to it all right let's see <clears throat> if only you could uh, just delete and sacrifice things in this. <sighs> it's it's a tough call trying to decide what to put on which weapon because I have started to use my shotgun a lot more, but I use the nail gun as, a, like, a sniper rifle, and, like, the shotgun only happens if shit goes bad, you know what I mean? Otherwise, I'm pretty much using the nail gun. If shit goes bad, or I decided to try and run and gun it, which is not the best idea in the world for me in this game. I can't remember how much I hit fire things versus... Aim down sights. I mean, obviously, I aim down sights for the nail gun, but. <laughs> she does go back quite often, that's fair. Uh. <laughs> Alright, I think I'll leave that for the other gun. Accuracy beam shots is greatly increased. Hmm. Okay. 
Uh, significantly increases range of which weapon is accurate. Significantly increases range of which weapon is accurate. Why? Why? Oh, for some reason it looked like there was different spacing in the sentence there for me. I have no idea why. Well, probably because I'm high, but... You know. <laughs> um... Will those stack? I think I've asked that before on some of these. Yeah, mobile marksman makes sense for this. Let me get rid of this. This full damage is increased. All right. Think I'm good. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm good at this. It'd be cool if you could give your knife upgrades. Uh, can, did I? No. Okay, that other gun doesn't show up here. That's what I thought. Is that just the weapon I pick up at the beginning of every loop, or have I been picking that up myself? I wonder. Okay. <clears throat> We're going for this one. Video silence. Archive's office. Yeah, it's for the next day cycle. Also, it's nighttime. <laughs> so many loops. <sighs> I don't always remember because of how many loops there are, and each loop, uh, even if like you're going to the same place, I'm pretty sure depending on the time of day, they don't spit you out at the same point. Um. They spit you out on different areas of the map, depending on what time of day it is in the loop. You really so it's fucked these people up. Hey, the Eon program may be. Which you're a part of. So are you. Everyone I still was. thinks it's the first day. No one chose it's this. It's better this way. Memory can be a treasure and also a curse. Profound. You trying to forget anything specific? You would know. I would know. Yeah, granted, now now that I do have a bit more of upgrades on stuff, I do kind of feel like running gunning. <laughs> I'm gonna die though. What did I do to this particular Eternalist? Like, I've killed a lot of Eternalists, and this one's like, nah, bitch, Colt's gonna get it. That's funny. <clears throat> I guess I'll do that after this.
Are they making a trap that I'm supposed to follow? What is this? Why is it in a row like this? I don't know which way I should go. Whoa. You guys see that? There's someone in there, but when I zoom in, the window's closed. Neat. They can see me, though. That's fucked. You can't do anything with the information you've learned. You're stuck on an island in a day loop. I mean, they're making progress on some things, but like, you're still stuck here, man. Yeah, that's gonna hurt a lot. Knives do too. Jesus, I keep waiting for the person. That's really pretty wallpaper. Always the second floor, isn't it? Is this the second? Technically, this is the third. All right, this is the second set of stairs. What? Okay, someone from Eon's been redecorating. Oh, no one's here? I swear I heard footsteps. I guess not in here. I don't hear it in here. Sound like bleeds to the wall is really weird. Uh all right, 60 second minute, Juliana Blake. With so many incredible passions, how do I organize my time? I've always been so fastidious with my time, but there's never seemed enough hours in the day. I can't wait to have infinity of them. <laughs> Given my unbelievable success, what's my greatest regret? I burned a bunch of bridges to get here. Only one of them I wish I hadn't had. Oh, I wish I hadn't. Only one of them I wish hadn't had to go. God, did not read that. <laughs> when did I realize I possess a vision greater than the rest of humanity? I'm a gal in love with the written word. I'm hardly alone in that on Black Reef. What book song I play most speaks to my spirit? Books like that metaphor about never stepping into the same river twice, except it's the reader that changes. Same with songs. Gotta say, though, Birds of Praise are a real righteous jam. What did I know I had to bring with me to Black Reef? Some people brought complex electronics or a whole sound studio or an eternal supply of candy. I'm just glad to have my library. It's one of the world's greatest living geniuses. Do I enjoy finally having a spotlight shining on my work? It's new, that's for sure. I'm going to make the most of the responsibility you've given me. It's so weird to have an interview with yourself. Like, it's weird to read an interview with yourself because the way they're phrasing the question is like, obviously, by them to them. Okay. I guess I probably don't have to sneak. Doesn't seem like anyone's in here. Wish I could close the door on the place though. That'd be nice. Uh, 
Um, also... Wait. Where to... Where to... Oh, this is her office. Maybe it's in, like, her, her bedroom or something like that. I'm wondering where all the books are, unless they're all in here, but that doesn't make sense. Um, what? M Moff X to O. Memorandum for Katrina Pishek, head science officer, Tidevarv Station. Subject, rock access. Anytime I hear rock, I think of the fucking monsters in Borderlands. Uh, as per the f field marshal's orders, you have been entrusted with a pass key to the Updown Rock facility. This pass key is t Tambor. Contents of this communication are strictly confidential. The field marshal has expressed concerns that a single audio lock is insufficient security given the importance and sensitivity of the equipment within. You may provide any thoughts on the matter to him by way of communications office at Yasin Station. Victor Raznik. Alright. I already know where you're hiding. Yes, and what do you want? What do you want? A medal? A fucking ribbon of achievement? You are. Uh, you're so aggressive. Uh, at the stabilizer core. Oh come on! I was almost there. Uh, you're not even remotely close. Look out the window. See that giant fucking eye? That's me. So you are hiding in plain sight. Uh, the problem, Captain Vaughn, is that I see everything. I see moves you haven't even thought of yet. Better start looking for ladders. Hmm. There's no ladder, is there? Right, again! Shit! <laughs> There's no ladder, is there? <laughs> uh, the constant companions, confidants, allies, friends, by whatever name they pick you up when you're down, expand your horizons, and support you when you're in dire straits. In short, they weaken you, they betray you. <laughs> They rob you of opportunities for growth, opportunities to prove your strength, your will. The great beyond cares nothing for your friends. It's, it is emptiness, loneliness. You are the only constant. All else is dross? Dross? From Echoes of the Great Beyond by... Oh, great. We have yet to deal with Harriet Morse. <laughs> or did we only deal with her just recently? But it wasn't much of anything. It was actually kind of a... For... Uh, well, let me make sure it's the person I'm thinking of. Because if it is, it's like... No, not Juliana. Uh, who did we fuck with last time? Oh my god, I'm not going to find the information here. No, I think it was Harriet. Um, But we just didn't take the slab. Um... Yeah, that was a kind of a lame boss fight, but they were they were talking her up as if like she was the only one that took took me as a threat seriously because she was staying like in seclusion. She went with the game plan that everyone said they should go with, which was if like or when I did rebel against them that they should all go into seclusion, not meet each other at any point, not be in the same place at the same time, um, and surround yourself with people that would die for you, pretty much. Which is the point of all the Eternalists, to save the Visionaries. Um, am I hearing that from something? I don't know where I just got that. Um, and like she locked herself down in that facility with the gas and stuff like that. And even though it took me a while to figure out that you're supposed to go through that stupid window, um, shouldn't seem, shouldn't seem all that tough, I guess, comparatively. Once I did get through that window. Well, hell, I didn't. I killed her without getting into it, so. My point exactly. Shouldn't she be, like, hiding in a corner and tell? <laughs> That's, like, the sole purpose of the Eternalist is to be the sacrificial lambs. In hopes that she stays alive. Alright. Charlie constructed the Moxie. Uh, what? Laser rip? Laser riff? Is that a real word? Laserific? Kaleidoscope of time challenges? On the lower road of Updom, apparently there's a prize and also a big prize. That sounds terrifying. Uh, Moxie can be set to easy mode by hacking the control system in the nearby cellar, but that might help someone else win one of the prizes. I remember reading that, but not that it was a laserific, laserific kaleidoscope of time challenges. Uh.
Or die. Well, some weird highs and lows when it comes to difficult shows and difficult. And all of a sudden, there's that house with the 50 guys in it. Yeah, that have nothing to do with the... Well, it's like leading up to stuff, but it's not... You'd expect that during the boss fight. That kind of rush of people. Not just them all chilling in a building together. I definitely agree with that. There's some weird choices in difficulty uh, levels. gonna no shinies in here really surprised there's nothing I can absorb I really notice that on the way in that's sketchy like someone was tortured. No blood though. Guess that's a plus. What the fuck is that noise? Yeah, I've been to this door. Tamper. All right, let's find out what's inside this rack. Oh, we're going with rack. Got it. Tamper. Unlock the rocket. I'm assuming we're safe in here. I'm just. Take a quick peek, see I have no- oh, lockers, I think. Okay. Good, no paperwork? It's a uh, rat? It should. My men tell me the anomaly's energy will be past its peak on the proposed date of the demonstration. So, we uh, have to accelerate the schedule by six weeks, otherwise the probability of a successful breach decreases to just 16%. The RAC team confirmed they can make the deadline if they forego the ejection seat, the life support system, and drop the shock absorbers from the landing gear. Uh, the pilot, uh, Lieutenant... Uh, oh, that's why it's a uh, death. Sorry, yeah, it was... been promoted for this. Captain Colt Vaughn has been briefed and he's still 110% on board with the flight. Yeah. In other words, we're moving forward with it. Maybe you can use that to impress the commission. <sighs> Please excuse that I didn't call you immediately, but this is too sensitive and your line is probably tapped. Wow. Well, you know, that's fine. Just <laughs> because you miscalculated something, uh... Just totally jump the schedule ahead of time and make it a death mission for the person that gets to pilot it. That's totally fine. Actually do that. Anything else in here? Racchetto plan. Right. <laughs> I knew that. Sure you did. Where the power lies, greeting citizen, in case of anomaly, collapse, enemy attack, catastrophic systems failure, or other emergency, the power station at the complex functions as a massive fuse, cutting power to any or all of the following facilities. Tide Barb Station, the complex, Yasin Station, Updom, Sova Station, Fristad Rock, Akar Station, Carl's Bay. Other Operation Horizon facilities are either independently powered or draw from the local power grid. Power can be restored via the power governor in the power station control room. The code for the power governor is 579. 
This information should be communicated responsibly on a strictly need-to-know basis for the motherland. No wonder Juliana didn't want me in here. Yeah. Let's juice up those other stations and find out just what exactly Horizon left behind. What I don't understand it is like if I'm not losing this information for the loop, Juliana wouldn't be losing this information for the loop. Why? So why wouldn't she just be here and have taken that information from me already? Scared with an audio log, which caused my... Yeah, I already did that. Why are you giving me that now? For the motherland. Should I say something profound? Uh, ocean. Pearl diver. No, 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 no. It's got to be military and unimaginative. Um, bomb. The hell is this? Wow. Well, I thought you were going to say the thing that was, you know, on the wall. That's f funky looking. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was saying. We, yeah. Some fucking rock nests. Rack nests, whatever you want to call them. I think I always called them rocks. Since they were like. It, a rock in the ground, pretty much looking. Until they weren't. Until they were attacking your face. Alright, um. I mean, we could we could die. We we could afford to die. We have a we have a couple loops. I haven't died yet. But that is the objective, like the main objective, to finish off that storyline. Got some traveling to do. What was that shuffle she did? Stop walking, bitch. Is it, oh, is this, uh, hopefully I'm safe here. No. Oh, this is the moxie. Yeah, okay. shit to do though like if i don't want to die <laughs> yeah she looks super drunk but that was like the weirdest like weird shimmy she was doing i don't know she kind of looked like a zombie i'm feeling just fine is everyone gonna show up when i press this Same. You start by pressing one of those fancy buttons. 
Well, he said all of that in a semi-sexual way. Weird. Is that the prize? Huh. I'm I'm a little curious to see what the fuck it all is. But I also don't want to die. Science it once, I guess, and hope for the best. They turn on. I what if they? I don't get it. Will they just turn on on me then? But that's what they're doing. But I can't see them any longer. That's my time frame in which I have to get across. I'm confused. Why did everything go invis? God. Damn it. Well, at least I don't die. It's just like, can you do it? I thought I was gonna take health. You know? Shouldn't say that until I'm out of there. Alright. Okay. Well, that that's a good thing then. I'm okay with that. <laughs> um, I assume this... Like, it can't just... Power ran out. I think that works though, eh? I know time is just a construct of black green, uh, but in this game, it's real. And you only have uh, 30 seconds left. I don't know what happens when it goes down might step out of the door by the time it goes down. Just in case. <laughs> That's just for the big prize, I'm assuming. Hopefully nothing happens. thing fuck so close if I slid at the end maybe I forget I can slide That was cool. Trixie. I'd be fucked if I didn't have the slab though, eh? And that doesn't make me uh not weigh anything, so <laughs> unless I blink or shift across. I touched it? I didn't feel like I touched it. Yeah, I'm gonna shift across it.
Who's coming into me, I guess? Oh, are you Um, am I am I supposed to only be on the the white? I assumed I, it was the other way around. Oh. Gotcha. I was going the other way around. Like I had to dodge those. I feel like I'm playing Portal. I did not expect this. Wait, these don't even have names! Oh, pressure plates again? And lasers. Oh, okay, okay. Alright. <sighs> Jump over it. Run and slide, hopefully. Oof. I I wasn't sure if my head would tuck under that. Alright. Bollocks. I feel like I'm playing fucking Fall Guys. I feel like I'm on it. Apparently not. Another power. Yeah, these buttons in particular just make me think portal, I guess. I mean, I'm being tested as well, but I think it's the buttons that are doing it. life-threatening so far so I feel pretty okay I thought this was all gonna be life-threatening if I failed but apparently not might get to it at this point I can see him changing it oh, bollocks <sighs> Hell yeah. Where's T? Oh yeah, no, if I hadn't had this ability, I'd be fucked right now. All right, good luck with work. Sorry everything's stupid today. Ah, you have to jump between them. You can't like diagonally go between them. I got the other one first try. Don't be rude. I'm trying. The fuck was that?
Ah, fuck. I can't really remember the pattern. So I'm just kind of going off of what I see in front of me. I probably should shift. Oh, come on! I should have double jumped. <sighs> I might be able to figure something out in like the timing of it. But the pattern itself is confusing to me. Ah, ended right there. Fuck. Oh, come on! <laughs> Woo! I should have blinked! I should have blinked! Why didn't I blink? Would have saved me. Ah, move right there. Blink, woman, blink. It's your stupid shift slab. Ah, oh, I thought it was. I thought it was gonna go under me in time. Right into the gap. Oh, shut up! No, this one clearly isn't. Funk. Congratulations. Oh, seriously. Oh, well. Didn't need to tell me that one. Until next time, player. Looks like a shotgun? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna go drive that blink. Yeah. The fucking shift slab, not blink. Whatever. You think that'll open? Or will I die if I go down that? In our hearts, it's called Blink, yeah. What? That's not the way to go. Are people are gonna come after me? From what he was saying? Oh! I thought they were going to be right at the door and like flood.
bastards. I knew this was some sort of trap. I thought the games were gonna do the damage. Not you calling everyone in on me. I heard one other guy. I don't know where. Anyway. Shit. That was not me. My bullets do not do that. <laughs> I guess he was about to chuck something at me when I shot him. Oh, it's so freaking burfy in here. Like it's usually people here. Noises that happen when like things are ref oh, that's the present. Fuck. I don't think it's gonna stay here. <sighs> Regardless of time of day, I don't. This might be a one-time opportunity. I do still have. A uh, loop. Looks like I have to go pull a lever on it. Did she just say I cheated because I used my ability? <laughs> I kinda hope that's the case. Is it a gun? A slab? Looks like a slab. Will that guy see me?
I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I might go across the rooftops because I gotta get across, but. What was supposed to happen, I wonder? <laughs> Why would you not go invisible for that? It's clearly a tarp. <laughs> Why would that not be a trap? Come on now. Yeah, I feel like, yeah. Maybe more than usual if you do set it off. I feel like other people will see him die, but I kind of want to just pick him off because he's kind of in the way. Damn window. I didn't know someone was in here. This is my place too. What the fuck, man? You're trying to kill me in my own place? Go into a different room in that place? Oh. Got eyes on the traitor! Whoa. Pretty, but a sniper rifle? I like my nail gun. As basic as it might be. the one for myself but with so many incredible passions how do i organize my time soldiers tend to have the time regimented for them given my unbelievable success what is my greatest regret making the same mistake more than once when did i realize i possess a vision greater than the rest of humanity hey i just run security <laughs> what <laughs> book song or play most speaks to my spirit frank spicer is the voice of our age what did i know or what did i know i had to bring with me to black reef this jacket just about the only thing i've managed to hold on to one of the world's greatest living geniuses do I enjoy finally having a spotlight shining on my work not particularly a spotlight usually means somebody's gunning for you yeah as a security person yeah super brief um shit man why can't I carry four weapons I I, I don't I really don't mind my loadout <laughs> But if that's all I'm using this for, then why would I not have a sniper rifle, you know? But I already have this one infused and like things equipped to it. Either way, these things I can't use in times of, like, immediate danger. I have to use them before anyone sees me. Because I can't shoot them fast enough 
when people are actually coming after me. So I guess I see them as equals in that, right? Steady aim. Put my slabs. It's twenty five. It's not like it's overlapping and in, in ammo. I wonder how difficult it is to shoot comparatively, though, because that seems like straightforward. I wonder if there's uh, like dropping this. Oh, the struggle. Change. And this already has stuff equipped to it. That's the main problem for me. It just seems like the enemies are not necessarily ever far away enough for me to warrant a sniper rifle. Like they're when I can finally see them, they're they're actually pretty close to me. For the most part. There's only been a few instances where I couldn't hit them with that, you know? With the nail gun. But I wonder which one is easier to find ammo for, because I do kind of sometimes run out of nails. But I don't No if it's also been that difficult to find nails. Oh my god, the struggle! Fucking hate it. Um. If that's bound to me, even though it's off my person, will I spawn with it? The gun model's a bit on the big side. Yeah, it blocks my view a shit ton. It's very large. Compared to that. weird um fuck I think I'll keep keep it a little faithful hopefully I don't need a sniper rifle later Do I get in there? Leave the windows open, I guess? Damn. That was a decent amount of health I did not need to lose. Got some drinks in here? There's people over there. Already got full ammo. Really? Oh, because I wasn't crouched? Is there really no more fist pop in here? It'd be funny if on one of the rounds, um, one of the loops, the bathtub's just filled with fizz pop. I guess I try a window.
supposed to do? Hold on. Send him the code? The paper? Like this place is blonde to smithereens. Ah, there's a paper. Wow, Otto, it's not even noon and you've already ruined opening night. <sighs> Ruiner? <it. laughs> These buildings are like a quadrillion and a half years old. Only a dick brain like you would think they were wired to suck down power from all over up. Damn, Frank, Frank will never forgive you. Expect a song about what a stupid, hapless shitwit you are to be playing all over Black Reef within the next few loops. Congratulations, Elena. Wow. That was such a, a very helpful No. Make her burn down a shop in the morning by siphoning energy from all over up down. Great guy. Alright. Uh I wonder how many people are really left on the map. Where it's just Don't mines. Uh, is there anything else to do here? I feel like there isn't. Not a fan. Just go to the side, I suppose. Well, I know I've already killed people. God, oh my god, please. The noises are horrendous. Done nothing. It's fine. Yeah, we got a lot done in that. <sighs> Even the random moxie thing. I mean, granted, we didn't do it quick enough, but whatever.
Uh, Rock can get me to the stabilizer core at the power station. I can use code 579 to divert power to other sites around Black Reef and find the rock passwords. Great, yeah. <sighs> Requires three passwords to open. Okay. Not at home, not in the office. Almost like she doesn't want to see me. Juliana set herself up on the antenna that powered the loop. The rack is my key to catching her, but it's inside a password sealed vault. This island studded with dusty old bunkers. It sure Better is. start digging. Um Sorry, the reason I was smiling there is because like throughout this entire game, she is the only visionary that just randomly decides to be like, you know what? I'm gonna try and kill you. Right now, for funsies. Just gonna show up where you're at. This random loop. Join off you. See how it goes. So the fact that we're having trouble finding her, I'm like, well, no shit. <laughs> and also, couldn't we just wait for her to come to us at some point? And then just have that be the day we kill everyone else? This workshop is intact in the morning, but something causes it to burn down by noon. Yeah, because Otto's a fucking idiot, apparently. Trying to siphon all the power. Alright. Yeah, I mean, as important as her character seems to be for the entire island to exist, I'm a little surprised that she's just willing to be like, I'm just gonna try and single-handedly take you out. But, even though I'm a really important person that a lot of people rely on for this island to keep going. <laughs> Scope rifle. Oh. Oh, I was supposed to get shot with that sniper rifle? Has a name on it. What's the chance it's not a trap? Sniper shot at me from the bakery's upper floor apartment. No, they didn't. <laughs> they never saw me, bitch. <laughs> wow, so I literally, because of how I did that, I could have missed out on this weapon if I hadn't decided to go into that room. Because I never heard it... She just said, you cheated. She never- I never heard- they never shot at me. I mean, I, I didn't take the sniper rifle anyway, but that's kind of... Hilarious? I could have totally missed out on that because I cheated. And never got shot at to never hear the sniper rifle I was supposed to actually get. Weird. But I, I, I do love that they allowed that- like, allowed me to just... Go in viz and take it. I didn't just get shot at regardless, you know. I hella cheated. Yeah, but it again, it kind of almost cheated me back because I missed I almost missed out on that sniper rifle if I did want it. That's funny. I love on the oh, on the speaker. You cheated, Colt. <laughs> Immediately. The second I did that, you cheated, Colt. <laughs> <sighs> Bare-handed assassinations are quicker and kicks do substantial damage. Damn. Wow. The trinket drains your health in exchange? Jack shit. Why would you... What do I even have on me? Double jump. Uh, max health moderately increased. 
turrets so deadlier stronger oh yeah so I have a shit ton and I'm not really I don't have anything to infuse so I might get rid of that now that I've stocked up some I don't know I don't know Damage dealt in one mode bus other. Hmm. Depending on the situation, that might not be bad since there are sometimes a shit ton of people around me recently, but... I try to keep that to a minimum, so I don't think that will be helpful. This one, originally I didn't care about, but I, I'm kind of more interested in it now because I do have that invisibility. Um, if I use that invisibility and I'm running at them, they can still hear me. They just can't see me. So they still react to me. They just don't know where I am. Um, so I'm kind of like... Maybe I should be quieter. So... More sneaky sneaks? I assassinate people fizz like without I I don't like just pick them off with a sniper here and there, but I don't know if it's worth it to have that. I don't kick people that much. I eat them off cliffs every once in a while, but that's just like opportunity when they're near a cliff. I don't wait for that to happen. <laughs> I wonder what it, what would have happened if I had kicked that person that was leaning up against the rail. I assume they would have just checked the rail and then started to attack me. Sneaking works pretty well. Yeah, they definitely did allow for the sneak of Dishonored. Alright, so I think I'll, I'll switch that out. I don't use turrets as much as I originally thought I was going to, but I do like to have that as a backup, so... Um, I can't, do these just stay on me regardless? Or I've infused them so it won't let me do it now. Maybe that's what's happening. Um. Cause I wouldn't mind keeping it, just switching it for now to see the difference, you know? Jesus. Not three of the same thing. Uh, still don't understand how to upgrade those. Because I'm supposed to get the same one and it adds effects, but... Pretty sure I've had the same one in front of me. Nothing gave me the option to pick it up. So that's cool. Let's see. We're in evening? Okay. I always click the wrong button.
We're almost done on all of these, so I kind of feel like I should do that, but at the same time, I also just want to finish all these out and then go to that. Hmm. What does it say for that? At noon. For some reason I didn't see that. It's, um, okay. A lot of up down. The plan. Uh, Alexis Dorsey is a rare target, easy to locate but not so easy to find. Alexi is throwing a lupine masquerade with tight security, so. So, which wolf's the wealthy host? Fan fucking tastic, everyone's in a mask, so which wolf is the big bad? I need clues to identify Alexi. I found something that could trick Alexi into revealing himself, which was his chocolate beer. He's the one that's going to be drinking, like, vast amounts of chocolate beer. Or, rather, whining about the fact that he doesn't have chocolate beer if I destroy his supply. So I'm assuming that is going to be what's happening. Because it showed, like, barrels of shit, right? Um. Chocolate beer, yeah. And he, he, he wants it. If he doesn't get it, he'll make a scene. Yeah. And that beer supply is in the basement. So we're going to have to go after that. Okay. That is the plan. Alright, um... I'll be right back. I can keep playing. For a bit, so... I will... Burp. Alrighty. I guess let's uh, go sabotage some beer. The the, <laughs> the word choices. I've got to dominate him for it to death. Not a good enough reason to use the word dominate. Hey, you eat. Yeah, once I figured out, it, it did take me a while to wrap my head around how this game is supposed to function because it definitely is out there compared to just your normal 
uh, linear storytelling. Even if you do have some choices, you get to make to change things. Um, this works a lot differently. You literally get to just do whatever you want, whenever you want, if you choose to do it. It's really weird. I also feel like you could literally just wander these maps and and restart a day without having achieved anything. You could just go around and kill everyone on the fucking map and then go to the next part of the day, kill everyone on the map, go to the next part of the day, get none of these objectives done and restart a day and think you've done something, but you haven't. If that's how your mind is like trying to take in the game, you know? It's really weird, but I, I like it. The Different approach to a game, for sure. But it did take me a while to get my head wrapped around it. Um, but these, this definitely, I feel like is just a rip from, well, to some extent, I think that this mission is a rip from Dishonored. Uh, is it Dishonored? One or two? I want to say two, but... Um, where you go to the masquerade ball-ish thing, and everyone has masks on, and there's the three sisters that all are identical. And you have to decipher who's who. Maybe that was one. I don't know. Same concept for this, though. I'm pretty sure this is a time zone, though, that... I got my ass whooped. I almost died. Ugh. Sorry. Almost actually died. I did die like twice. Because it's it's the time of the party, so I think everyone's at his place, right? <coughs> and that's when that flood of people were coming at me. How many people do you actually think that was? Dear lord. That was like... I want to say at least 30 enemies. Around there. Just flooding. Pretty much. I'd say around 30. I didn't know, or, yeah, I didn't realize that my shotgun has a slow effect, so whoever I shoot with that, if I don't shoot, if I don't kill them, they're slow, they're at least slowed down while they're still running at me, which is nice. Too many? Yeah. That's a good way to put it. It was too many. There's a lot of people in that fucking doorway. Thank goodness for that doorway. If y'all could get in the same room early enough, it would really free up my afternoon. Yeah. I could grab some lunch, do some sightseeing. Yeah, I'd love to help, but do you really think you'd survive against all of us at the same time? Maybe not, but I Maybe. bet I got real close once, didn't I? And that made you nervous, because you like keeping me here, watching me die over and over again. I don't like watching you die. I like killing you. There's a difference. She's not wrong, but damn, that's cold. I don't like watching you die. I like killing you. Uh, I can, I can believe that, though. That there was a point where they all tried to just take him out. And he, and... He almost got there, but not quite. I get a picture of them. Ooh. Right, she comes over and talks to them. 
I forgot she comes over to talk to him. I kind of want to just take her out since they're both looking at her. That shit would be hilarious. Who are you strapping to fireworks? I wonder where she goes to though. Aww. Wait, you weren't even facing him. See, I don't know how easy that would have been with a sniper rifle. That was pretty darn easy with this, you know? But I'm also used to this. Fireworks? Juliana, come on, doll. You never shot at me. Honey, what was with the fireworks? <laughs> Juliana here. Wanna hear your favorite visionary? This is voice. ironic. There are speakers on every street, so listen up. I don't know what happened with the with the havoc. What does that do? To become brutally incarnate, deal more damage and receive less in return. Oh, it's just like a rage mode? That's kind of cool, but I like being sneaky. Now that I figured out how to use the invis, the invis is really coming handy. But rage mode might be helpful for what's ahead. And again, I still have the question because I have this one infused. Do I have this one? Do I have this one infused? I'm not sure now. <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure I have this one infused. Jesus. Um. 
so once I could take this and then when this loop is done, it's nighttime anyway, I'll just get it back and this will be gone if I don't infuse it. I feel like that's how that would work. Or does it not because I kept it? That's the one I chose to keep. That that wouldn't that wouldn't make sense to me though. I infused the other one. So when I start a new cycle or a new loop, it would be the one I infused, right? Shit. I don't know. I feel like I'm not doing too bad with what I have. Granted, that doesn't mean I couldn't do better. And with as many people as there is up there, that might not be a bad thing, you know? I guess I'll try it out and see what happens. He's slippery, he just kill himself. Just gave up. Okay. I'm scared to figure out why you were screaming. <laughs> I'm surprised the turrets don't fight each other. Who else would be attacking? Do other people go rogue randomly? Like. Hurts don't seem to do shit right now. One, there was a lady there at one point. Hmm. 
Also, if I had had the invis thing, that turret wouldn't have been nearly as much of a problem. kind of just expected it to be empty. Alternate button I didn't know existed. Neat. It did not work when I clicked it. I feel like I entered it over there that last time. That's how it was. Someone was watching him. I remember I dropped down into this place. Oh, come on. Why'd you gotta be right behind it? Fuck, lady. You wanna shoot me or not? comes from that way, I'd be impressed. Kinda sounds like they're trying. Hello? What? what do you mean I can't shift through there? That's like a clear line of sight!
That's really frustrating. That makes no sense to me. I feel like you'd be able to do that in Dishonored. Oh, for fuck's sake. Not realize this would awake the entire complex. I see the what? Um. I'm gonna run out of ammo at this rate. Why would he come all the way down to the cellar? I just fucking headshot him. Just one shot. I can leave no buffs compared to any of the other guys. To protect his drink? Yeah, he loves it that much, apparently. Oh, fuck. So I had already fucked it up because apparently shooting the two shooting at the two people in the cellar alerts the entire facility somehow. Um but like why? The programming to just let the boss, who looks like every other motherfucker. Like, and I know that's the point of the mission you don't know, right? But like you still don't let him just walk down there? That's so weird to me. To just let the boss just walk into everything. Hmm. Also, just because I'm not sure. Skeptics. Big heads. You can do it. I believe in you. Give me my shit back. 
Oh, wrong one. Thank you. I done goofed it. More information for other people. <laughs> It's the only way I can look at it. Tomorrow. Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> I accidentally killed a visionary. Also, I am I am still frustrated at the fact that I couldn't shift through that space. That seems really really silly to me, considering other things that I've been able to shift through. And Juliana, you were a joke, honey. You almost you practically killed yourself. Eternal life, same for the body, unless you. Well, maybe they still would. I don't know. Considering they had that headshot fucking sniper rifle for the trap. Oh, can I have sacrificed them there? I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, probably. Oh shit, I forget about that. Um... Fuck me. Well, that's why I kept this anyway. Never really got to see how well that did because I didn't get into the place to use it anyway. The uh, sneak. So. Wait, fuck! God bless it! this game's menu system I done goofed it again <laughs> I didn't infuse any of the any of the trinkets for the weapons my weapons aren't boosted anymore Oh well, we'll pick up more this day anyway. I'll be fine. But that is highly unfortunate. <laughs> Go back to the rock. Power to the other side of Black Reef. Oh, I do kind of want to continue with that. Just because I thought we would get farther and not just find out that this place was destroyed. Hmm. Yeah, I should probably call it here. Uh, we might... Continue with this then instead of going for that. Uh, power at the rock. Rack. It's rack in this. I keep thinking it's Borderlands. Um. Yeah. Probably go for that. And then we'll start via sing in the afternoon after this. <sighs> Darn, man. Those are good things, too. 
I totally forgot. I didn't infuse that. <laughs> I had the residuum for it, too. <laughs> <sighs> Alrighty. Uh, I, I want to say that the better trinket trinkets trinkets were weapon trinkets were like I I felt like they were in a certain time of day in the loop. It seemed that they dropped higher trinkets, higher level trinkets. Maybe it's just because of the objective I was going after? I don't know. We'll have to see when I start this one, I guess. There's nothing I really can do now besides just continue with it and pick up the ones I do pick up and use them and infuse them. This time, for goodness sake. Anyway. I hope you have a good one. Thanks for hanging out, Wheat. Thanks for hanging out, PCM. I hope. All the shenanigans for all the registers go well. <laughs> and everything else that's gone haywire today. And you're not uh, stuck there too long? Unless it's one of those days that you are stuck there by scheduling. But Alright. I will see you on Thursday. We'll continue this. We'll go to the fireworks thing and then we'll do uh, Fia's stuff. We'll start Fia's storyline since that's the only one we haven't really gone through somehow. I feel like I know enough of the crazy, but whatever. <laughs> Have a good one, guys. See you third night.